What's up fam, it's Brian Castrello. Just watched Mandalorian episode seven titled Spies. Yes, that's plural. And if you're staying much past this, you know spoilers are coming, so you know what to do. But this episode, probably my favorite in the entire series so far. This was amazing. And if you go to my pinned video, I think this is big towards uh, my eventual prediction that Mace Windu lives. But we see Moff getting his back and he's in a secret meeting with the Shadow Council of the Empire. And one of the big things they mention is Grand Admiral Thrawn is coming. At least one of this guy believes he's coming. Obviously he is. But uh, Moff Gideon basically scoffs at Thrawn. There is definitely going to be some tension with those two coming when they finally see each other. But he gets his reinforcements, and then there's an, um, we see Mandu and Grogu, and they get IG-11 back, but they call him IG-12, and they move this little, his basically his belly for Grogu to sit in, and he's got controls to, you know, ru run around with him. And he learns how to say yes and no with the, the machine, and it's just, it's hilarious, the whole scene, especially the part where he finds yes, and he's like, yes, 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 and Mando, Mando's getting annoyed, and this just brought me to Family Guy, where Stewie is like, mummy, 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 I was just laughing my ass off, but... Now we got Bo-Katan getting all the Mandalorians together. They get to Mandalore, find some other Mandalorians that were kind of stuck there, riding on a pirate, looking like Pirates of the Caribbean. Um, but the, my favorite scene on that was when Paz Vizsla and Axe Wolves are playing chess and they're fighting. Grogu breaks up the fight, but it just brought me back to Luke Han Solo and Chewie let the Wookiee win. If you know, you know. But as they go down, we find out that it's a trap and there's stormtroopers in Beskar gear and this big fight ensues and they get trapped in there. Moff Gideon comes out and and he, he's basically saying to Bo-Katan, he wants his sword, um, the Darksaber basically, and she eventually helps everybody escape in a very Qui-Gon Jinn-esque where she's cutting through the door. But then my man Paz Vizsla coming out like a damn guardy, like he was a badass taking on everybody, killing everybody until finally they have Praetorian guards come and to take him out. Give that that man by the end of this, he had better get a statue memorializing him because that was one of the most badass moments in the entire Star Wars um, lore. That that was absolutely amazing. But but yeah. This is big. I'm nervous for next for next week. It's the I believe that's the finale. But wow. But who are the spies? Now it could be Axe Wolves. He's the one who kind of escaped to kind of go tell everybody we didn't see him. Maybe it's the armor. And I hope it's not Bo Katan. But there are obviously more than you know one spies because it's titled spies. But what did you guys think? I loved it. What do you guys think?